snowy part, we've dropped down in elevation quite a bit and it stopped even raining. So the road's drying up, it's looking good. So we're just gonna keep heading towards Moab. So I don't know if you can hear that, but that's my turbo. I put a different, uh, well, it's kind of a cold air intake on it. And uh, it's, it's pretty loud. It gets around 2,000 RPMs and it uh, makes all kinds of noises. It's kind of cool. But uh, after so many miles, it kind of gets annoying. But it's not like that all the time. Just around a certain RPM. And I know that there's different, like the Wicked Wheel and stuff, to take care of that. But this is a stock turbo. And it just kind of makes you think that Ford actually did a pretty good job of keeping that quiet. Because you couldn't hear it before with the stock air box. But yeah, as soon as I switched over to the cold air intake, it gets pretty noisy. So we're just rolling into Moab, just going across the Colorado River right now, so we made it. All right, so it's Saturday, it's a little cold and rainy, but we're gonna do some iconic trails today, maybe fins and things, Hell's Revenge. So we're just gonna go out and try to have a good time despite the weather. So sit back and enjoy and thanks for watching. Slide on down.
just finished up the first short half of feds and things, kind of just a little warm up trail. It was good times. So we're heading over to Hell's Revenge now, and uh, we're gonna give that a go on this wet, cold, rainy day, but we're having fun. So yeah, hang out. So today we're in the 1949 Willys CJ3A, and we just got a soft top on this thing, and. We got a heater, like it's just an aftermarket heater that got it stuffed under the seat. Works pretty good, but uh, only if you're going slow. If you're going like highway speeds, it's pretty worthless because with this soft top, it just blows the wind through here and it gets pretty cold. But when you're on the trail, just doing your thing, it works out pretty great. So, so far the, the old red Jeep's running pretty good today and no drama yet. So we'll just continue on, see how she goes. Okay, so we're at the head of Hell's Revenge. So we're gonna give this a go, see how she goes. A little wet, a little slick today, but not too bad. I think we'll be fine. So let's give her a try, see how the red Jeep does. Oh, Brett's room for air on this first part. Just stay in the center, hope for the best.
we're in the middle of hell's revenge trail we just stopped for a little lunch just offside the trail here and we grabbed us a little bit of moab diner special lunch on the way out of town best lunch in town anyway we're gonna finish up eating lunch and continue down the trail Revenge and it overlooks Colorado River. It's pretty beautiful up here. Yeah, don't if you get on this trail, make sure you hit this spot because it's pretty cool. Towards the end of the trail, it's amazing. So yeah, we're gonna keep continue on and see what else we can find. Just enough to get your blood pressure up and shake your hands a little bit. It's all good. Pictures never do it justice. So we're done with Hell's Revenge. It's a great day, great trail. Not sure what we're doing tomorrow, but hopefully it'll be just as good. 